All right, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Movie Mike, man. I'm doing these tutorials. Uh, shout out to those that, you know, asked for it. Trying to give back. That's how I learn. That we're doing a little wedding tutorial. Uh, just how to do something real basic. We just want, all we want to do is drop a file on the timeline. Cause that's how we start. Dropping a file on the timeline. So, I, I've already got it loaded up on my project assets. Um, this is where my files are. Everyone needs a file. Got this file of 58 seconds. Drop it down here. Shout out to Katina. And Courtney Stroud on their wedding. Thanks for letting me be a part of it. All right, so I'm gonna take it from the top. First thing I'm gonna do for my own purposes, I'm gonna turn the audio down. So this is your audio file of it, the video and the audio. Turn the audio file down all the way. Or I could have right click and went to delete audio. Either one. All right, so what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna move forward to the spot that I want to start. This is my wife, Dorothy. Get them straight. Shout out to McDermott Events. Bam. Get my light right. Alright, get it where I want it. Wow. I like to start out unfocused. That's my style. Anybody knows me. Everything's all blurry. I do it on purpose. Sorry. Right, I'm getting a little closer on it. And move forward. I'm going to start right here. Good. See, anytime I cut, I delete and close the gap. This is how I get rid of it. Press play, see what we got. A little shaky. So that's nice. The door is heavy. I'm going to the double push. Delete, close the gap. So you notice when I cut it, all I did was just cut it with the scissors and delete and cut that little section out. I use that every day. Another push. I'm going to go where I don't want to cut. This time she's going to push it all the way open. So cut that. Delete, close the gap. Bow. She should walk out of it. Alright. There she looks bad. That's beautiful. Boom. So you notice it got real bright. So what I want to do here is I want to cut where it gets oversaturated. About right here. It's kind of looking heavenly right there. But damn, it gets to be a little much right here. So I'm going to exit. And. Then right here, I just alter the color on it. You know, so alter. Let me adjust. I can put a smart tone on it, or I can just go to the color. Take the saturation down. Make more to a black and white type thing. Anytime I do that, I like to put a cross transition right there. Just kind of make it seamless. Cross this all. Wow. Okay. Boom. Throw a little music on top of it. And then I'll be the first. So that's what we do. Put on a little timeline. That's how we start it off. So we can manipulate it. Uh, I'll be back with something else. Pretty basic. Real simple. Yeah.